Not so long ago, the end of winter was marked by large flocks of Canada geese flying north and the sudden appearance of American robins hopping around on the freshly growing grass. Ask any non-birder, and they may say that these two birds are the first signs of spring. However, as years have gone by, these two species often spend the winter in the north as long as food is available and no longer signify the turning of the seasons. That being said, there are several bird species that still wait to arrive until the worst of winter is in the past. I'm Derek from Badgerland Birding, and these are the top five birds that signal the arrival of spring in Wisconsin. At number five is the boisterous marsh bird known for its brightly colored wing patch, the red-winged blackbird. Red-winged blackbirds migrate in large groups, often associating with other blackbird species such as cowbirds and grackles, just to name a few. The species typically arrives in large quantities in early March and can be found in marshes, open fields, and at household bird feeders. While there are some red-winged blackbirds that overwinter in the north, their large flocks are distinct and noticeable as the snow melts away and are a clear sign that spring is returning. Coming in at number four is the sandhill crane. The sandhill crane is one of the earliest arriving migratory bird species in the north. They typically arrive in the last few weeks of February and are extremely noticeable due to their size and distinctive bugle-like call. During migration, sandhill cranes gather in staging areas where their numbers can reach into the thousands. Much like the red-winged blackbird, some sandhill cranes do stay the winter, but they don't start showing up in numbers until much closer to spring. Coming in at number three on our countdown, is the killdeer. The killdeer is the first shorebird to arrive in the state each year, taking advantage of flooded fields and sandy plains. This species arrives at about the same time as red-winged blackbirds and sandhill cranes and is often spotted within a few days of the cranes and blackbirds being reported. Once they arrive, they are a common sight and are known to lay eggs and reside in gravel lots, cultivated lawns, and flat muddy areas. The killdeer is known for its broken wing display to lead predators away from their nests. More killdeer arrive as winter fades away, and seeing them is a sure sign that it is soon to be spring. Coming in at number two on our countdown is a species that will be very numerous in the summer, the turkey vulture. Turkey vultures ride thermals high in the sky and can be identified by their V-shaped wings that separate them from most other large soaring birds. This species is rare in the northern parts of the U.S. from November to late February, early March. When the first one is spotted, more are sure to come, and following that, warmer weather will as well. To those waiting for summer to arrive, the turkey vulture is a welcome sight. Coming in at number one in the countdown is the American woodcock. During the winter, this bird is nowhere to be found in the Midwest and Northeast, with the exception of the East Coast. They winter as far south as Florida and Texas, and are one of the earlier migratory birds to move back to their breeding grounds. Woodcocks are much more likely to be heard than seen due to their painting and flight display noises, which happen as twilight approaches. In fact, these courtship displays that include flying up and spiraling back down to the ground take place throughout the night and well into the morning. Due to the fact that they are rarely seen in the north outside of their breeding season and that they are one of the first birds to noticeably start mating displays, the American woodcock is the bird that most signals that better weather days are on their way. Even with a vast array of technology at our disposal, humans still look to Mother Nature for clues as to when the seasons will change. While other plants and animals are often used to gauge the arrival of spring, these five bird species are a consistent sign that the winter is indeed coming to an end. Do you agree with our list? Leave a like and comment and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on Badgerland Birding.